Hey guys, it's time to do a little Hot Wheels unboxing video. Now, uh, I purchased this at my Shopco store, and a lot of you probably don't know what that is. I think those stores are mostly just in the Midwest, um, kind of in rural areas. It was about six bucks. Little mega jump set here. So, it's just, it's really neat. This is a new kind of format that I've seen. Um, just these little stocking stuffer size sets. I think they're pretty cool. Uh, copyright 2012 and it was indeed released in late 2012 so it's just a little set uh, the thing that's interesting though uh, it has these team Hot Wheels characters on here I've seen boxes that don't have these guys so I don't know that's interesting but it's the same set and we'll look at the back of the box here just uh, to show you what it has and it's interesting that it has the instructions right on the box there so you know exactly what you're getting and how to put it together. It's not a very big set at all. In fact, uh, just for size comparison, here's a standard Hot Wheels car. So you realize how small it really is. It's a pretty small set, but it's cool. Because it does come with a car, and then you got your clamp here. I believe it's four pieces of track. Typical, like, foot-long track, I think. So four pieces. We'll see when we open it. And then a little jump here, so... Let's open it up. I'm excited to see this little set. It's a pretty cool design, especially for stocking stuffers, and I hope that they, you know, make a few more variations of this. And I know there is also a launcher set, um, basically the same size box that comes with a launcher and then like a, a little uh, fireball thing you're supposed to shoot through. Just another small little set. Anyway, that's all that's inside this box, so let's take a look at the goods. And it's actually just three tracks, not four. That's kind of too bad. This seems like really short. I think they should have included an extra piece of track, but whatever. Uh, we got three connectors. Uh, the parts to the clamp. This just screws in here. And then the little jump piece. And I'll open up the car here quick. can read it on the bottom. Phantom Racer 2004 copyright made in Malaysia. So cool. This is kind of a neat little car. And with that said, let's uh, I'll put it together. And there it is. As you can tell, it's little. But let me just go ahead, move the camera around, and we'll set it up and try it out. All right, so I'm gonna hook it up to my dresser here. It's kind of hard to do this while holding the camera, but you just twist it. Twist it into place. Make sure it's level, and you're good to go. So, let's try it out. Now one thing about this clamp is you actually have three sections where you can attach the track. So if one section doesn't work out, you know, how you have it, uh, whatever you have it attached to, you can switch it up. So I'm going to try this way. Let's see if it works any better. Oh, 
All right, guys, so I'm just going to quickly wrap this up here. Again, this is the Hot Wheels Mega Jump mini play set. I thought it was going to be pretty boring just looking at the box, but actually when you put it together, you realize if you use your imagination, there's actually a lot you can do with this set. Just get a whole bunch of cars. You can have like a contest to see which car will fly the furthest, you know. Uh, you just got to use your imagination. So it's pretty cool. So five or six bucks. Depends on the store, obviously, what it's going to cost. It's a good stocking stuffer type of present. Um, and, of course, you can attach it to other track sets. I'm going to give it a 5 out of 5, you know. And I, at first I said that, you know, it should have had four pieces of track, but three is okay. It's not bad, as long as you attach it to, you know, you can't attach it to, like, this drawer up here. There's not enough track, but if you attach it to something low to the ground, like a stool, it'll work just fine. So, again, Mega Jump, go pick it up. That's it.